Whoa, there's so many um, zombies outside. Alright, I'm gonna be safe and actually <laughs> not go out there. What's going on, guys? Mr. Connor out here, and I done a fair bit, and still my armor has not broken. Oh, yeah, that's right, I have enough armor, but I mean, I have enough iron to make full armor. So, I don't know why my armor is not even breaking. Um, wait, I just made that. And I don't know why, I think because I haven't. The most box I jumped off was probably be three. So I don't think your armor can break from three blocks. But um I'm gonna show you what I've been working on. And this took a long time and um my mind now is even bigger. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you what I've been doing. Um if you wanna see this being built, just tell me. Oh, and by the way, I tweaked this out a bit. I added a roof to it. Um, if you want to see me building it, I will put it on. Um, just leave a comment. I'll put it up. Um, okay, so this is pretty much all I've done. But this whole thing here, because I had to build it again. Well, most of it. I had to extend it out. One, two, three, four, five more wide just so it's in the center of this and I had to keep taking that down pulling it apart pulling it back up over and over and now I'm stuck with a problem which I'm gonna tell one of my mates on Skype what I should do because um I said I'm gonna be doing my farm down here but I'm not sure how I can start it off because I have to do terraforming if you can see I've done quite a fair bit because there's all water there and caves I still got to fill in this cave here but I got quite a few iron from here um there was a stack not stack there was like uh three four iron blocks put together so I got a fair bit from that um I think I'm trying to do is find sugar cane which I know where it is it's in that direction but the thing I'm facing now is, um, I'm not sure how I'm gonna do my farm. So, I'm just gonna keep, like, terraforming. If you don't know what that means, it's basically, like, making it how you want it. So, like, say if you don't like this, you'll take that all down. Um, and that's basically what I've been doing for a couple hours now. I know how Brennan feels when he does his hardcore, how much effort he puts in, because it's so hard to keep coming up with new ideas and trying to be different um, building-wise, because I don't want to do like what other people do, so that's why I pretty much done this. Um, hmm. Alright, I gotta fill that cave up, but first I'm gonna make, well, a iron bucket and collect the water. Oh, well. Alright guys, um, you might be wondering how, where did I get all that couple and dirt if I didn't went mining. Um, wait, where are my sticks? I swear I had sticks. I had sticks. Alright, there they are. Um, I'm gonna show you what I done and oh my gosh this took forever um 17 will be enough for now all right so this chest is just full of cobble and dirt um when i was doing this i was talking to my friend on skype and i nearly died i got down to, uh, i got down to three hearts because i was running down here and i ran on this by accident and I just fell off right under there. And yet I told him why didn't I get no armor damage. So yeah, I don't know why. But look, look what I have done. <laughs> I took a lot of stuff. I mined this whole thing out. If you remembered, this whole wall was where there's torches. Um. 
I mined this back and if you remembered um after I quickly explore this I need to put some torches here look look how much coal there is whoops lag um if you remember there was this wall from all the way there all the way to here as you can see where the, all the stone is uh, if you remember that was all stone wall I mined the whole thing out actually I had TNT because I had tons of gunpowder and sand because there's sand in that direction um, I covered this up but that was the cave and this I have to push that back more um all right oh the sugar cane um so if i walk around this mountain my house like the inside is just over there but i'm just gonna go quickly get the sugar cane i don't know how i missed it though all right i think that's all of it nine so now i can make um enchant stuff with my chicken so far I only found two sheep and luckily I got three wool out of it and I made a bread, a bread pff, bed. Um, Alright guys, so I took a break from mining down that mountain and this is what I'm going to do for my wheat farm because it's really quick. I can do the same for a potato farm or a carrot um, and this is how it works. All i got to do is hold down and just keep placing down seeds and right when I place it down I get wheat and you get heaps and heaps in under a minute so this it's not really compact at all it's mainly four dispensers uh, the top one with water and the three bottom ones with bone meal and then this this is what I'm going to make on my hardcore but first I have to get all the ingredients for it so I'll be back when I have all the stuff to make it and we'll be <laughs> and we'll build it together. Alright, so what we need was redstone for the dispenser, sticks, and string for a bow. So a bow is like this, I think. I'm not 100% sure because I haven't made one in a long time. Okay. And we need cobble. And. Whoops, sorry about that. If I'm correct. I think it's redstone on the bottom, bow on top, then couple around. So that's one dispenser. So you want to make four dispensers. So I'll be back after I make four. All right. So I dug all uh, this wall back seven, because that's how much space you'll need. Just seven, and then you'll need four high. And it was a pain because I had to go mining again because I ran out of redstone. Um. All right. So what we'll do is to start off we will put a pressure plate right here um you know what let's just push this wall back to make it even all right so that's done so what you want to do is get your block of choice it can be anything you want um but first you want to put a pressure plate right there and then you want to get your dispensers and you want to do this uh, sort of shape just a little semicircle and put dispensers like this and make sure that is on top because this is going to be water and all these three are going to be bone meal and now you get your block of choice and you basically do that just putting, put it on top of each other um, then you want to get your fence gate and put that in the middle. So that's pretty much the first step done. Alright, and now we need a sign. So we'll just quickly make a sign. Do we have any more sticks? No, we do not. Alright. So make a sign. Um, why, why does it keep doing that? What the hell? What is happening? Alright, I'll be back after I find out what's happening. What is happening. Alright, so hopefully it's fixed now, and yes it is. 
Alright, so you only need one sign and you want to place that just above the fence gate and then what you want to do is okay so we got the water um what i'll quickly do is make a infinite water source so say if i run out of water let's just do it here water here and water there all right put water there and what i like to do is make a slab like this and let's put that on top like that all right now you can put your fence gate back and we'll just move the water for now like this and then what you want to do is I don't know why I keep clicking that but you want to just make a little staircase you don't have to make a staircase you have to make a little platform up here just like this Alright, so now the roof's gonna be in the way. Jump and make basically a square. Now I should have thought about this before I recorded. I knew I left something out, like as in breaking the roof, but um oh well. That will do for now. And after you do the little um three by three, I think it is, we just gotta get off the roof and come behind here. Now you wanna make a two gap like this and get your repeaters out put a repeater there there and there and then get your redstone and hook it all up just like this now we'll put a lever here just for the moment but we're not going to turn on just yet and now all you gotta do is put two repeaters whoops just went there five so you want this one to face outwards and then you want to put the other one inwards so I gotta go make some more repeaters and I'll be back okay now as I was saying now we put we place this repeater facing this way now what you want to do is place one this way um, if that makes sense to you so you want to place it opposite and you want to put put the repeaters on the last dial code I think that's what it is or the last tick and then all you gotta do is put redstone behind it. Um, just connecting the two repeaters. So just like this. And that's it for the bone meal pot. The reason you put that down there is because you don't want it to power the water. That's what I learned off the uh, YouTuber, YouTuber I watched and I'm gonna link his channel in the description if I find it. All right, so next you, what you wanna do is come up the top. So, I'm going to be real cautious with my stone brick. Alright. Sorry about that. And now you want to put a repeater facing this way and that way like what we just done before. And just click on them once. And this is basically the last bit of redstone. Then all you got to do is this. And get another lever. And we'll just have, oh there it is and put that here now what we have to do is make these timing right so firstly um, if you want just quickly double uh, double tap this lever so it makes that noise and then do the same for the bottom just double tap it and now to find out if we made it work is first we need to make a hoe um we'll make a cobble because we won't really need it that much there we go make a hoe take that uh take our seeds all right hopefully i get this right the first time because i only have one more bucket of water then you want to come over here and hoe the ground and you want to put your bucket of water in there and then you want to put your bone meal in there so I should have actually got bone meal out of here I only have two bones so I can't really make much all right so it's six and basically you put your bone meal in there and your water in there so let's see if we run this right um put our bone meal in here actually we got to stop it 
at the moment just because it won't work if we have it going because then we the water won't be stackable um you only need one water in there which is good so we'll put one two in there two in there and two in this one then we want to put water in here obviously this won't really work because i only had six bone meal but then all we gotta do is just keep placing um seeds and we'll be good so we'll first start it off with this one all right so that's dispensing and pretty much wasting it all right so let's see if we have it good all right there we go see and that's all it's going to be doing now you only need one bucket of water just because it will keep repeating itself see how it just keeps filling it up now all i have to do is put more bone meal in there so what i will do just for now is turn off the sound because that will get really annoying so that's it for this episode i hope you guys enjoyed please leave a like or a comment below seeing telling me what you want to see next but um that's what i'm going to do for my potato and melon farm so i'll see you with another episode real soon bye guys